Hi everyone, thank you for coming to Grace Extravaganza and I am excited to share with you about the project for Fund the Need this year. So last year you helped us raise money to put a brand new HVAC system in the dining room and that has been a wonderful gift, thank you. And as you know our building was remodeled and that was finished last spring but the parking lot wasn't included. And so we have people who, you know, come in for services, but the parking lot is not in great shape. And especially for those who need, you know, who are using a walker or need a little extra help walking, that becomes a dangerous situation. So we want to show you a little bit about what it looks like. So this part of our parking lot is used to access our community garden. And uh, this is a concern for us because it is not safe for people to walk on. We don't want people to get hurt just because uh, they're coming over either to volunteer at the community gardener or to grow their own veggies. One of the reasons why we are asking you to help raise money through Fund the Need is that we get grants and donations for specific programs, so our programming is pretty much covered. But we don't have grants for infrastructure or for building purposes, so that's the main reason why. Another concern for not only the people who use our services, but also with our volunteers, is that our parking lot doesn't have any lighting. And so our English classes, for example, go until 9 p.m. So really we have programming here Monday to Thursday until 9, and that's dangerous for them. This is our parking lot for the Boys and Girls Club. As you know, we are the site for the Oletha unit for the Boys and Girls Club. And this past year, we had 252 students, children and youth enrolled in this program. So this parking lot is heavily used by all the parents who want to drop off their kids and pick up their kids, and also by the club staff, and it's in pretty sorry shape. So the north parking lot is mainly used by our volunteers who come to help with the community dinner. And as you can see, it's also a concern. Part of why I think that it's important for us to do this together, to, to make sure that people have a decent parking lot to drive into, is because we have a beautiful building but really, if we want to respect each person's dignity and we want to welcome them beginning when they pull into our driveway so that they don't have to worry about their safety by the time they get from their car to our building. So it will be a wonderful thing to offer our community, a safe parking lot and lighting. Thank you.